Now let's take a look at the new secret weapon used by a lot of the leading athletes around the world. A number of professional and amateur sporting clubs around the world, including China, Australia, New Zealand, have actually purchased go to altitude training devices for the benefit of their athletes. Both their, their health and well-being as well as their sporting performances have all benefited from this device. The way the go to altitude hypoxicator system works is it draws in normal atmospheric air which is around about 20.9% oxygen. The air then hits the semi-permeable membrane and some of the oxygen diffuses across, others doesn't. What then happens is the machine draws out nitrogen enriched atmospheric air to provide to the athlete to breathe which is lower in oxygen concentration and hence the athlete gets less oxygen supplied to them. So what benefits does this have for the athlete? The benefits of IHT or intermittent hypoxic training for the athlete are quite wide and diverse. Um, we actually see an increase in the concentration of red blood cells, which means the athlete has the ability to transport more oxygen around the system, which allows the athlete to stay aerobic um, in their exercise for a longer period of time. We also have a bolstering of the immune system function, so the athlete doesn't get as sick as often, and it also has a, a little bit of an improvement in the athlete's ability to recover between intermittent exercise as well. At the moment, Brendan's breathing air, which is the equivalent of being at the base camp of Mount Everest, which is about 6,000 metres. The air at that level is only has about 11% oxygen compared to normal atmospheric air, which is approximately 20.9%. Quite simply, the benefits of that are that it will stimulate the body to produce more red blood cells, which makes it easier for the body to transport oxygen around the body systems. So for the ordinary person? Research out of the Soviet Union has also shown that IHT has had beneficial effects for people suffering from chronic fatigue syndrome, female infertility and general health and well-being. So let's talk basically, how would this help me? Basically how the device works is that the body is stimulated to produce more red blood cells by the hypoxic mixture of gas that is delivered to it and as a consequence of that the body's immune system is also benefited and we have a whole host, a cascade effect through the body of um, beneficial aerobic benefits such as increased fat metabolism, um, improved immune function, increased red cell concentration, improved oxygen delivery to the working cells.